doesn't give up. She just keeps going and, and keeps figuring out what works for her. So we are very, very proud of her. She's amazing. A seven-year-old from Watsika is raising money for those in need. She's hosting a lemonade stand with proceeds going to a nonprofit that makes prosthetic legs. But that's not the only reason she's doing it. WCI 3's Jamal Williams is with us. Jamal, this story hits home for her and her family. Yeah, it does, Brandon. Amputee Blade Runners provides artificial legs for athletes, adults, and children. Ellie Smith is one of them and wants to do anything she can to help. If you want to come out to my lemonade stand, I'm raising money. First grader Ellie Smith is doing her part to help an organization that's done so much for her. She was diagnosed with amniotic band syndrome, which caused her to lose her right leg. But it hasn't stopped her from doing the things she loves. Backbend, mm -hmm. cartwheels, handstands, front walkovers, back walkovers. Growing up, she's always used a leg that was heavy and limited her movement to do athletic activities. Two years ago, her family found Amputee Blade Runners, a nonprofit in Nashville, Tennessee, that helps lower limb prosthetic athletes. Her mom, Tanya Smith, says it was a great fit. It's really, really light, and she, she calls it her bouncy leg because she can really bounce with it. The main thing um, is down at the bottom. It has like a little mini blade that um, helps her when she is running and jumping. Um, she doesn't really waste as much energy with this leg as opposed to um, her other prosthetics. Tanya says it's been a blessing watching her daughter live her life despite her condition. She helps inspire other families to keep encouraging kids with physical disabilities. Never give up with, you know, believing in them and never give up with finding the things that you feel like they need to make them um, everything that you know they can be. She said the nonprofit needs $3,000 to reach their goal of 52,000 to help 15 athletes. At least fundraiser is tomorrow from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. For, for more information on how you can support, visit our website. Back to you. Jamal, who wouldn't want to buy lemonade from her? What an inspirational story. Thank you.